back to the Goons Podcast. The only podcast in the world where the host can speak backwards. Yes, foot, yes, foot, yes, at foot. Yes, foot. You Tell probably said something really racist <laughs> if they were the audio. Yeah. But you'll never be able to know. I would actually, actually like to. One hour of backward speaking. We're going to do a whole backwards All the best topics are at the end. All the worst topics are right now. One hour of back ASMR. Kill your parents. Hey, and kill your family. <laughs> well, Satan wants you to eat kill your dog. The voices are telling you to. Are telling you to. <laughs> okay. All right. People really sit down and go. Can't First wait to topic of the to day. This. Favorite cheese. Go. <laughs> and probably not the red. Oh, not the bad I think cheese mine is choice, my friend. Provel. Huh? What is happening today? <laughs> You're gonna choose what? Provel. Prevail. What kind of cheese is prevail? The band. Prevail. All shall prevail. <laughs> I prevail the cheese. All, right, prevail. All shall perish. No, dude, uh, what the fuck did you really say? Provel cheese. cheese. Provel cheese. Provel? Yeah. Portabella. P R O V E L. <laughs> no, P R V V L O L O V. P V P. Provolone? Montage. Is that what you're thinking of? No, it's Provel. I'm Googling this because I don't know what the fuck Provel cheese is. This is fucking stupid. This is really dumb. Yeah, yeah, it's Provel. It's a white processed cheese, particularly in the Oh, dude, come on. A town. Provel. He said white. Provel sounds like a football player. We got cheese Provel as a quarterback. Provel Johnson. All right. Um. Gouda. I didn't mean to cause so much controversy with my cheese choice. Mine is probably fat free craft singles. Uh-huh. <laughs> yes, queen, yes, yes, queen slay. Yes, queen. Lower calories. Yes. So, what would be the premium cheese for Cheese Dog Blarg, being the referee, creator, and master of the game? Yep, <sighs> Cheese Dog. Dog with a cheese. Literally craft singles. Okay, what? No, it actually wasn't a craft single. Fun fact: little bit, of, <gasps> little bit, of, little bit of dog <gasps> cheese lore for you. It was, oh, it was, it was a a Cracker Barrel cheese slice. Damn! Whoa! Are you sponsored? No, no, you should do it again, no, but use like a like a brick of cheese instead. Well, my just, dog boom. already died, so I could throw that. Oh. Co- cheese dog like died. Corpse. What the fuck? You should have announced that. Oh no! It was a great day. That dog was a no, dick. because then Peter would be cheese all dog. over him like, you know what you don't got? You know what <laughs> cheese got the cheese got but into his you... pores and he died. Yeah, I was gonna say that. from don't the you... oils. Tweet like bacon pics at PETA until they no, like they, ban you or something. They were like, mm. they were like, veganism is the only way a human should eat. And I just replied a hot dog. That's it. Didn't even say anything. And they blocked me. <laughs> just one hot dog is all it took. What a bunch of fucking idiots. Fuck PETA. Okay. I, well, like yeah. I sound like a really upset Lois. I think- <laughs> Fuck PETA. <laughs> That's so dumb. That so fucking stupid. Come on, stupid. McNasty, you should appreciate that one. I like Family Guy, but that was just dumb. It took me a minute. I was like, upset Lois. Is she not like hot dogs? <laughs> it's, ah, right. Yeah. PETA. Well, I think PETA, PETA is pretty genuinely like hated, though. Oh, yeah. They no, they're, they're, they're scum. Yeah, he's definitely yeah. my least favorite character. Okay, that's enough. Still <laughs> rolling with that. I was still <laughs> <so> <laughs> with the Family Guy jokes here. It's just kind of misunderstood, so I think. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Go ahead. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay, sir. <laughs> you that? must atone. Dude, this might be the worst like 10 minutes I've ever Post-it had. Post-it note sandwich. Go ahead. I stand by what I said. <laughs> okay. Um. All right, hold on. I can ask you about it now. McNasty, how's your truck? It's a fucking truck. McNasty, mm. McNasty wouldn't let me ask him about his new truck unless he monetized yeah. it in a podcast. Right. We can no longer have any normal conversations. Yeah. Everything uh, you hear I, on the podcast, we, that uh, we're the only time the we talk. Time. Yeah, we yeah. sit in silence in Discord. We're legally I obligated spent 113 to racks on that truck. I better make a little bit of money back on it. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. I'm, I'm proud of you. Uh, so, congratulations. Oh, oh, what the fuck? Headphones screechiness. I'm glad you're driving a truck and got some testosterone in your pecker. I'm happy for you. Yeah, you got the, what, the Hellcat engine in there too. I got, yeah. I got the new, I got the new <clears throat> Dodge TRX. It is a 702 horsepower Hellcat engine. I, I thought it was 703. Supercharged. Ah, 72. 
Oh, I'm gay. They lost a horse. It's actually a little bit lower than like the Hellcat, like Chargers and stuff. But I'm assuming it's just because it's fucking so much heavier. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's what it is in the other ones. I don't know. I don't know too much about American well, cars. If you but... get a, if you get a Hellcat Challenger, they can go up to like 800 horsepower. Well, yeah, the, the red eye one and the uh, and the demons. So how many yeah, grandmas do you think you could pull behind you in that? Oh, at least nine. <laughs> Bare I think it's rated for 8,100 pounds. You can you grandmas, 8,100 grandmas. You know what's funny is <laughs> wow. the whole nursing the rating, home. <laughs> the rating for hauling on the TRX is 8,100 pounds, and the rating for the hauling rating for hauling on the Ford Raptor is 8,000 pounds. So they really just one upped them by 100 pounds. Well, yeah, you I mean, don't really buy a Raptor to tow. You would usually buy an F250. Well, yeah, neither the deal. Dodge TRX either. Yeah, yeah you don't buy. The, yeah, the that, TRX is a, direct, is a direct competitor to the Raptor. Yes. There's a, there's a picture on the inside of the console, like the um, like the middle part where you pull up and there's like the part in the middle where you can store shit. And on the pull bottom, up! on the on the bottom, thank you, I appreciate it. On the bottom, uh, <laughs> <laughs> there's like a, there's an Easter egg and there's an Easter egg inside of it where it's a picture of a Ooh, human zombies? next to the TRX and then an actual T Rex and then a wow. Raptor right at the bottom and just like the Raptor's like really tiny. So they're really? like comparing the it to, the, yeah, it's, actually it's, kind it's, of funny. It's, it's like a marketing tool against, against the Raptor. Cause they just wanted to build something that was bigger and better. Yeah. Germans don't do anything fun when you buy their cars. They just, here you go. <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> I don't know. They had yeah. a lot of fun back in the day. They built these yeah. really cool showers. They yeah. Tricked people when they got into them. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they experimented <laughs> on people. Yeah. The Germans were really famous for their pranks yeah. and then it all went wrong. Mm hmm. All right. Mm-hmm. Okay. I don't all right. think it was wrong to begin with. <laughs> <laughs> this is an elaborate prank. They forgot wrong. to say it was a prank, and that's where they went oh, wrong. Oh yeah. That's so my, I, I have up. a question. Uh-huh. Uh, when when is the dude gonna get a a nice new car? I don't know. <laughs> what year right, is your it. is your car? I don't want to give too Enough. much information about anything. <laughs> what but year, model, make, and location is your car? My What's license plate number? number? Yeah, what's your license plate number? What's your driver's <laughs> license number? Wait, what's How your many miles you got name? in that bitch? Oh, it's what's probably the name of your first pet? How many apples car. can you fit in the back seat? What's your mother's maiden name? Carl. Carl? <laughs> <laughs> Dubra Carl. Carl. Dubra Carl. Uh, no, I mean, now that, now that I, uh, I have... Bill Gates' 5G chip in my shoulder and I won't catch AIDS, I'll probably go get something nice now. I don't know what I want, though. I was going to consult the uh, the council of, of Blarg. Let's go! I want to get something, something luxury, you feel? You yeah. know? Yeah. Dude, I didn't, honestly, I didn't think I w- wanted or gave a shit about power until I got power. Well, that's kind of, that's kind <laughs> of the like thing. like a corrupt politician. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> just stole all the tax like money. Like in a mud hut or something. <laughs> hey, oh! I did not think I want to own all this mud. Now I have the mud. I can't go back. No, I'm I corrupt the by the mud. Now. I am the mud king. You want mud? Come mud. to me. No one else can. <laughs> you know, you know, I have monopoly kinda, on mud. Could they right. like? Is there anything stopping them from making like a twenty-five bedroom mud house? No, no. So it's just their ambition. <laughs> I guess oh, sanitation so. issues and worms. <laughs> okay, I don't know if the worms are the biggest threat, but we'll keep them keep them noted. I don't I don't know if worms would just eat your house. Well, I mean, if your house was made completely out of mud, <laughs> my name worms? is mud. It's, it's not <laughs> six foot four and full of mud. It's is, not your name, what is, <laughs> bro. What is going on today? I've had a lot of caffeine. My name is Moore. Yeah! Yeah, I've also had a lot of caffeine. Ooh, tootin' a tootin' a readin' a tootin' list. All right. That's enough out of you, buddy. You're welcome, babe. Yes, please. Uh, no, what I, what I meant by what I said, though, is uh, just having a car with a lot of power. I didn't really think I would ever give a shit, give a shit about that. You ever it's go, fun. Ying, ying. What do you plan? Do you plan on, like, running down, like, the White House fence with it? Or, like, what is your plan with all that power? <laughs> dude, it's just fun. I it's just back fun, my, It's literally just fun. Like you so many people, I had it out for it. one night, and so many people stopped and like asked what it was, and like made fun we of would, it, has, it has launch option, so you can you can launch it off the start and just fucking yeah, launch just control, bitch. Blow it, blow it, like blow a bunch of people out of the water. People like we like be up next to like a somewhat of a faster car, and then we just fucking rip it, and then they pull up behind us like in the next light. Be like, what the fuck was that? Because nobody like this. These cars are so rare, and they're not on the road. 
People don't mm. expect a fucking truck to do that shit. So yep. you pull it out. That's and how it like, is mine too. It's really pretty cool. Like a lot of. I don't know if I have launch <clears throat> options. I don't know uh, you should have launch control. I'm, I think I'm, I'm sure I probably do, but I don't. I don't really care enough about all that to even. Find yeah. It. I just like it because it's nice. I mean, it's, it's just. just nice, it's know. just fun. Yeah. It's fun. Yeah. It just feels good to ride and everything. But it's my loud. truck has auto adjust like shocks on it, so almost everywhere I ride is so smooth. You know what I mean? It's just my uh, the the T R X has like a it has different modes. There's like sport mode. There's yeah. a Baja mode. Baja. Which I, I think yeah, that's yeah. for like that's for like if you go out in the fucking sand. desert. Yeah, yeah, yeah and you, you want to like race, and like kill be fast like in the desert, or run over yeah. some fucking people like you, Blarg. Kill millions of scorpions. <laughs> <laughs> bro, send them all to the Middle East. <laughs> I knew it was coming. Bro. Are there cacti in the Middle East? No, no. There's me in the Middle East. There's lots of me. Oh, well, you said you said cactus. So I figured, yeah, I, no, I said yeah. send them all. We're sending all the TRXs to the Middle East. We'll oh. Never lose. You know a war what's funny? Again. So the apparently the TRX is the biggest sellers are America and the Middle East. Because if you go yeah, in the I back, just need something. if you go in the back, there's like a, there's like a case <laughs> under the seat and it has like a, it has like, like car stuff, like a first aid kit and stuff. I think you're going to say like RPGs the, or something. On the, <laughs> <laughs> go to RPG down storage. <laughs> <laughs> well, it has like a fire extinguisher. It has like yield signs you can put down on the road and then like other shit. And it has a first aid kit. And on the front, it just says first aid. And then under it is just a bunch of Arabic letters. <laughs> so it's like they know that the only two people they're selling to is just Americans and Yakbars. <laughs> don't call us that. <laughs> Yakbars. <laughs> Mr. Yakbar, man. Don't call us Yakbars. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're fucking cursed. I know, well, I'm terrible. I'm glad you're enjoying your truck. That's that makes me happy because even though it's not something I would buy, it's always nice to have somebody else that, you know, enjoys automotive related things, escapades. Mm-hmm. Or there's Apoc. So. That's it good. Is. I'm glad you're enjoying it. In my it. entire life, I didn't give a shit about cars up until yeah, now. Yeah, you literally just gave me shit for buying a Porsche last week, and you bought a truck that's like only 20 grand <laughs> less. <laughs> that will depreciate much more. You know what's funny is like when I first started looking at cars, because I probably first started looking at cars like a year ago, and I just kind of like just in and out, like getting interested in it and just not giving a shit about it. And I was like, I was like, yeah, you know, I'm good spending like 30 grand on a car. And then this fucking thing comes out, and I'm like, you know what? Fuck it. 113 grand. I'll be shit. <laughs> <laughs> <You're fucked. laughs> see i sat there for a year going all right i want this car i'm gonna make sure you know i have my budget set up and i'm all good with it i didn't just waltz That's into a Porsche dealership yeah. and go oh hey buy that one and just fucking buy dip. i don't give a shit i was like <laughs> yeah, you know no. what? i'm gonna make sure i have the means and the capability yeah, make sure i'm, I'm good gonna... make sure if i lost my career tomorrow i'm still paying this and no big <laughs> exactly. deal yeah, That's well, the, I if, like, if i, I sold it right now i could probably sell it for the same I have the mentality where, like, if I if it's something like that, if I can't, you know, afford a couple of them, I I won't really go into it. Yeah, that's that's kind of just mm-hmm. thing, like, you know. Yeah, it depends. Know, if you're buying, that's just good buying advice. So if you're buying something like a luxury product that you do not need, like for yeah. example, a hundred thirteen thousand dollar truck, um, <laughs> the rule of thumb that I've always said is if you can't buy three cash, you should probably wait. Yep, so, exactly. I can buy three cash. Yeah, well, okay, then there you go. Okay. okay. I don't know if you need well, to the disclose thing is, that. So, but oh, okay. so, let's just say it. We don't need to. Why are we oh, need to get out of this? Just rolling at it. So, honestly, <laughs> hold on. Let me. Let me, let me. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, you nasty. Everybody I'm knows that you don't need to keep telling them. I'm not them. talking about. I'm not talking about money anymore. Well, I, I can't, but it's, there's nothing to do with no, my we money. No, don't want to hear Stop anymore. The, 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 the to reason, our listeners. The reason Stop that, flexing. Oh, sh- <laughs> Let me fucking speak. This is a podcast. Let me speak. Okay. Uh, the reason you bought I bought the podcast money didn't give us. The re- <laughs> <laughs> no. True. Yeah, enjoy that, that truck, bitch. True. <laughs> I sat here and talked 38 times for you to have that truck. <laughs> <laughs> okay uh the reason that i bought it because i i wasn't originally planning on buying it because they were uh-huh. really really over fucking market uh-huh. uh, market price but I f- this one was only like eight grand over market the other ones oh, were like only. 30 to 40 grand over you know market. that's a whole used car right well like i was planning i was eventually I, I was really planning on getting a raptor because it's like i wanted a truck 
I wanted a truck. Shut the fuck up, dude. I wanted my, a truck. Dude, literally shut the fuck up. $300. My current car is not even worth that much. So. And you make four times as much as we do. Uh, okay. Can we stop <laughs> talking about our finances? I'm not comfortable. I don't like doing I am this. not rich. I'm trying to. I'm trying to <laughs> Sorry, change just the topic lie here. To <laughs> okay, dude, you can. You don't have to lie. Just sit. Just don't say anything. All right. I think it's a pretty well known fact that YouTubers are kind of well off. Where none of us are fucking crazy rich like PewDiePie or anything. But well, no, not even we're close. We're well off. We make decent money. That's PewDiePie part of had millions like, oh, before creator. I even started. So. Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy. It's crazy. I think that PewDiePie like. He was like a YouTube, like YouTuber for like three years before he started making money. Well, you yeah, really I couldn't. Mean, a lot of people are. Like all yeah. of us. Yeah, kind of like, yeah. Yeah, except for, of like, except for you. Amazing. Amazing. Yeah, he wasn't making yeah, he, 100K his first year. Well, well, I mean, like somebody that's getting millions of views is not getting any money. Like to us, it was different because we weren't getting any fucking views when we started. My cock yeah. stinks. He was already the biggest YouTuber okay. by then, but still making zero dollars. Well, he was probably signed with a. Yeah, he was with an MCN. Is that fact by anything, or are you just speaking out of your ass? Well, for like, uh, I think up until like 2011 or something, like YouTube didn't. It was when Google bought YouTube. You needed an MCN to get money beforehand. Yeah, that was true back then. When Google, when Google got YouTube, anybody could do it. They decided to be partnered. Yeah. <clears throat> but yeah. yeah, I'm sure he was with an MCN. I'm sure he wasn't getting yeah, millions of I, views I for zero I don't think he was just like letting that slide, like McNasty saying, like it was just <laughs> going nowhere. Yeah, I'm pretty no. sure he was. You know what else paid. I let it slide? Turds out of my fucking corn shoot. How do you feel about that? Don't call it a corn shoot. <laughs> no one <laughs> says that. Don't call it that, please. <laughs> I don't like anything you've said today. You've the just been the worst that person shoot today. Shoot corn out of. <laughs> you've just been the worst person to talk to today. Uh, yeah. I haven't been that bad. Come on, guys. We're supposed to be. We're not. You know, we're not the Go kind of YouTubers yourself. that. We're not Go the kind of YouTubers yourself. that cause drama within our group. You know. Okay. Like, uh, I feel like you're throwing a swing. Like, uh, yeah, there might be something Another. going on on Twitter about <laughs> might some, be some psychopath man. Some middle Except aged it's man. It's not going to be put out for another six days, and people are going to be like, wait, that so was six probably days be, ago. Yeah, it'll probably be over yeah. with. But middle aged <laughs> man. ruin your being. career in 24 hours. What's you left know, of it? No, it's been about 48 hours now. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I like <laughs> Harvest Cheddar Sun Chips. <laughs> I like the Garden Salsa Sun Chips. Those are my Those favorite. Those are good, too. I've never had yeah. any. Recommend me French a onion kind of... I will try them. Or green... Is it French onion or green the green, onion? The green bag nasty. Yeah. Okay. I the think it's just green bag good. The original ones are kind of... Harry too. got a bag Sun Chip good, bro. I am very happy... No. With... No, that, yeah, I'm not. disappointed. Not. <laughs> I'm very happy with... I have not our, done my job, our, then. I'm very happy with our group. I like our group a lot. I like Shut you guys the fuck up. a lot. Why? You guys are just, I, I don't know. I feel like we all have our own, like, perfect place. You know? Like, uh, Blarg's uh, uh, the really, like, he's just the kind of, he's like it. the glue that keeps us together. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say a positive thing. I thought that was thing. going a completely different direction. <laughs> Blarg's kind of the glue, you know, he's kind of the, the voice the of reason of within us. I'm just chaotic. You're, you're, Clark normally you're just repeats baby what, bitch. what me or do says, and then you agree with it. Yeah, we yeah, have to like, talk like, you into it for whenever, a while. Whenever, whenever, finally, you come whenever, around. Whenever McNasty's mad about something, do and Soup will give him shit, and he'll tell him to go fuck off and die. <laughs> I will say the same thing, and you'll be like, "Yeah, I understand." <laughs> I feel like it's kind of like I, I almost feel like Soup and Do are like my mom and dad, and then <laughs> Blog's like my older brother. You know. No, it's like you don't, you don't want to listen to your parents, but then when like when your older brother, some of you like, can I be yeah, your mom? Tells you. <laughs> well, I was thinking I more wanted like to breastfeed dude, him. Do being the mom. Yeah. What the fuck? I wanted to breastfeed. Yeah, but dude's only like fifty. You know he's pounds. hungry, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, you'd, you'd have to just put the entire do in your mouth to get a yeah. little substance. <laughs> <laughs> I just suck out his essence. Mm. <laughs> you gonna make me hard on this podcast. I feel like that happens quite a bit. It does. <laughs> Here's the title. <laughs> the dude gets hard. The dude got podcast. a boner during this podcast. <laughs> Dude's cock live. Oh god, we probably it probably hit a million views and oh, like yeah. fast. Yeah. Dude's cock out revealed. Veiny. I could like slap the mic with my dick like you did that no, one time. No, dude, that was that actually might have been the worst day in my life. <laughs> when I when I put my headphones on, I just hear, and you just were like, "Yeah, it's my dick." 
<laughs> I, and then when we told him to stop, he did it, what, like two or three more times? It's no, just, no, no. So what happened is when I happened. first started doing it, Matt was like, Matt said, I'm going to go and get water. So he was gone. I kept doing it thinking you were there. Oh, and then you were like, deprived of the you experience. You were like, oh, I'm back. And I'm like, oh, well, I got to oh. fucking do it again. Step and boom, boom, boom. We are on the mic. Right, right. You felt what, bad that like, you missed that. Uh, yeah. What possesses I was doing you to it for stand you. up and hit your cock <laughs> off your microphone? Because I, I think I, I had, I've never done that. I've just never. I, I, had, my I either had a cold brew coffee before or a monster. I was just. I ready usually to, do it whenever I'm not recording. I usually why? do it when my face cam's on and I'm streaming. <laughs> That's not the very good. I'm usually half naked in a hot tub when I'm streaming. Ooh, That's good. You hear they got their own section on Twitch. I now? know. Good for them. Isn't it? Isn't it crazy how on Twitch the community can talk about something for a really long time and <laughs> Twitch just like is like yeah whatever. And then as soon as advertisers are like, we may not be wanting to put ads on Titty and Booba, um, which I just said the same thing twice, then is all there, of a sudden, is they're there just no like, ad oh, oh, huh? No, they pulled ads from like Amaranth and a, and a few of them uh, because they didn't want, you know, just literal softcore porn associated with their ads, I guess. And Bro, as soon I as that happened, that. why? Oh no, they're going to lose $20 a month. <laughs> as soon as that happened, <laughs> Twitch is like, okay, hot tub section. That's so cursed. it just kind of pisses me off that they don't listen to their community, but as soon as it's like it has to do with advertisers, advertisers, all of a sudden it's important. Yeah. You know? What uh, have I been saying? It's I just don't even understand why advertisers almighty care. Dollar, almighty <laughs> well, dollar, where are you today? Right. That they don't like Soup's been saying, like they don't care what it goes on. I don't I don't know what they got fussy about hot tubs and stuff yeah, for because I, I, it it hurts nobody. <laughs> It really doesn't. I'm gonna be honest. I don't think anybody's ever been like, "Nah, I'm not watching Blark stream tonight." There's a girl in a hot tub. Like, if you're there for gaming, you're gonna go watch somebody who's gaming. Like, mm -hmm. they're not right. stealing viewers. They're from not stealing viewers. Somebody no. speed running Mario Party. Like, it's just it, it makes no sense. Plus, it, they're I just don't there. Get to do it. Go to fucking Pornhub. There's there are literally because sites made to it's, jerk it's off. It's about the interaction. Yeah, you it's about being able to directly interact with the person that you're go fucking jerking your cock to. And it's just like it's <laughs> we're explaining it to you. We're explaining it to you. You said it's hard. There's an element. Trust me, I'm in these chats all the time. There's an <laughs> element. <laughs> <laughs> we sat in Amaranth's chat oh. and typed like Obama for like no, 20 minutes straight the other day. Sat in her chat and did that. Yeah, well, she didn't notice me, so I wanted to kill myself. But. <laughs> she didn't notice me, so I put my dick away left. No, she didn't notice Obama. Yeah, um, so I refunded my tier three and I left. <laughs> yeah. No, there's like an element of like, it's like, oh, what if, what if there's a booba slip? It's like, oh, you know, slip. like, on, on, on Pornhub, just, it's like you dude, can see dude, the full thing. there are a million fucking porn stars through history. Go yeah. pick one. But you're I'm just saying, this is what these incels look for. I'm just saying. They, 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 they don't want the instant gratification. They want to work for that booba. They want yeah. that booba to fall out while she's riding the banana. Yeah, <laughs> I, I think it's just more. I think it's more about the fact that they're interacting with somebody, and if they give that payment, then they get recognized, and then they get their name written on a fucking on the body, donut or some stupid on their arm or on their forehead. Exactly, if you pay that's, enough money. Yeah. That's what it's about. Like people, so, there's so many men out there that think that donating five dollars to somebody means that that girl just wants to fucking rail the shit out of your asshole, you know, or the don't? other way around. Sorry, I don't know. I'm weird. What? <laughs> Soup, I think the issue you're having here is that you actually interact with women. Like, you, you know yeah, how you to talk a, to yeah, a human a being. Yeah. So, like, <laughs> seeing somebody in a hot tub is no appeal because you could just go talk to a real woman in the real world and not sweat and piss your pants. Yeah. Whereas, you know, <laughs> these, these people have never these, touched a woman. Yeah, these incels <laughs> just have no idea what the fuck is happening. Right. So. Yeah. Well, dude, I think, dude, it's... It's mainly kids, though, and that's what that's what it bothers is a me. Little f okay, yeah. dog, bro, try to tell me you weren't beating the fuck out your dick at fifteen. Lie to me right now. Lie to my face. Yeah, but you you have to go out of your way to go. I don't know, dude. I I don't know. Okay, I'm not a fucking genius. I don't know. I don't like it. If I had a <laughs> cell phone when I was ten, I'd be doing the same shit. I'd be doing the same fucking shit. Dude, every every if I was a boy starts. Girl, I'd be doing the same thing. Girl, every boy, the every ever. young boy, fucking starts beating off at the fucking early age, and they get, you know, you get interested in women. And a lot of things too is like, for, in, in, in my in my case, in my case, when I was young like that, I don't like I hearing about your. I didn't like this. I know. Hold, hold on, shut the fuck up. Let me finish. If I when I was young like that, I I prefer seeing like women in bikinis or just like a pair of boobs. Like watching sex was gross to me when I was really young. Uh -oh. You know. 
Okay, I've, well, that's kind of what I was saying. You out like completely, actually. Like, the, I don't think that the people on Twitch want to see full on like pussy lips. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Well, I was, 10, I was scared do that. of pussies. There's nothing stopping them. Dude, I was scared of pussies. Is that Dude, what I, I just heard? Kid, I would look at a pussy and it would freak me out. I'd be like, "What You're the fuck a pussy is this?" About pussies? It looks like a sad clown. Gay. I don't want this. It's, yeah, I think I dude, dude I, would, I would I would I would print out a picture of boobs and go in the bathroom and beat off on it, throw it McNasty's away. Nasty's the gay you, one. You print out boobs. <laughs> you I would out. print out a picture of Bro, boobs off of Google just Images. Black and white ink, no <laughs> color to <laughs> <laughs> pretty Boob sure they probably had pen. better jerk off material during World War II <laughs> as a soldier. <laughs> Well, when you're fucking ten and you can't and you have a room with no and lock you on have your door. Printer ink and nothing else. <laughs> Well, I, my my door didn't have a lock on it, so I'd have to print it out and. Bro, like, why not? Like, dude, you could have just used like a gardening magazine at that <laughs> you point. Printed, you printed a picture of boobs to beat off. Uh-huh. <laughs> I, hope just, I hope your parents just went to use the computer and just saw boob JPEG on the fucking desktop. You accidentally fax it to your dad's balls. He just gets like <laughs> tits at the office. <laughs> Well, when I was, uh, I used to, every day after school, my grandparents would pick me up because my mom would work late. So I have like this two hour window after school and they, they had like to a print, specific, to r- print your to little print. heart's yeah. desire. They, <laughs> they had a specific room that was like the kid's room. And for some fucking reason, there was a printer in there and yeah, I'd print out some fucking titties and big mistake. Go <laughs> yeah. God, little did they damn. know. Yeah. Well, but, if uh, it makes you feel any better when I was 10, mm-hmm. I tried to print a YouTube video. <laughs> I don't remember what song it was. Deep as fuck. I don't remember <laughs> what song it was, but I remember trying to print it, not knowing what I was expecting, like maybe like a CD or something. And uh, <laughs> yeah, it just prints out like, the band. It just Please printed, print this podcast it just printed, from Spotify. It just printed in <laughs> HTML. <laughs> so why don't know, we just wild. print our own money? Why well, has no one ever thought of that? Because it's very illegal. I think a lot yeah, of people, people have thought about, thought about that and gone you know, to federal I mean, I, prison I for it. I wasn't joking, McNasty. Thank you. I don't know. You're, You're serious about some stuff. Okay. Yeah, I, w- I was serious about printing money. Oh, I don't fucking know. You're, f- You're... I'm joking, goddammit! I don't know. It's hard to tell. Your tone of I voice is the same forgery. with jokes and serious stuff. Forgery is illegal! <laughs> that a lot was of people, a joke! A lot of people print out small bills. They'll, they'll, they'll print out like a, a little guy named Bill and he'll run around and like help you clean and stuff. <laughs> I knew that's what you were going to say. went the worst possible place. <laughs> no, they'll print out like fives and stuff because nobody fucking, no cashier like looks up at a five at the it's fucking like, light. Oh, yeah, I got I to gotta scan this and make sure this is real. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm sure it depends how well you do it. If you put like fucking Marge Simpson on, I'm sure somebody's going to notice the $5. <laughs> in the I would take it, no questions asked. <laughs> yeah, this looks good. <laughs> Just give them the Coke and the fucking chip bag. Take the Marge five dollar bill. I think I, I think I know somebody that had a, a counterfeit twenty one time. I don't know if it was a family member or like a friend or something, but they didn't get the counterfeit twenty. Like somebody gave it to them to go buy some shit, and they took it. and It was fucking counterfeit. I guess it was being like circulated. Then eventually somebody checked it out. But Are they, they had, like, now the in fucking, federal prison? They had the police come and shit, and then like yeah, they didn't. They, they did like a little like investigation, and they just found out that it was just a dollar, a twenty dollar bill that's just been in circulation for a little bit. That must be an Daniel. awkward situation to be in. Like, you didn't know it was counterfeit, but it looks really bad on you. Yeah. Yeah, yeah there's yeah. not a lot of places that check 20s. I, I know that if you go to the dollar store and buy a bunch of shit, they'll, like, look at a 20. But, I mean, if you go to, like, fucking, you know, you know, like a a steakhouse and give them, like, a couple 20s. Ferrari dealership, just give them <laughs> your Marge money and leave. Yeah. <laughs> what are you when are people going to figure out you can just, like, take a gun in places and get stuff for free? I think a lot of Americans I mean, have already it, found that out. Yeah. It's a life hack I've been doing for years. Yep, yeah, that's... And I haven't been, that. you know, questioned You're yet. We're going to get another phone call from the FBI. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that I have to say another phone call is... Another phone call. <laughs> uh, the soup has a guy at the yeah. FBI. Yeah, he's got a homie. Did you intentionally try and rhyme that? Just I did not. He's but I realized when I started the sentence that it was going... Ew. You're a uh, fun guy. Dude, oh. say something funny right now. <laughs> it worked. That was great. I fucking <laughs> love you. Somehow God made damn. Past- okay. damn. Blark, say something funny right now. 
He can only make for. noises. It's like if you said that to a little baby pig. That's <laughs> <laughs> all I got. So for he's you. in the front right now. Pinch your case. Why? <laughs> <laughs> Dang, it can British. fit in me all. It doesn't work that way. You can't <laughs> tell someone to be funny. No. Work. I don't know. That's why I did it, because it's just like. <laughs> I don't know. It's just funny that. You can't just put people on the spot like that. I mean. They're like, they don't know what to do. You get, McNasty, you get say tape. something funny. Uh, He's going to say a slur. Don't. Don't let him do that. Yeah. <laughs> I know him too well. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay. Woo! All right. Anyway, do I'm we have speaking, a topic like 20 yeah. minutes in? Uh, I don't know. Is there anything else? 30 oh, minutes do in? Do you want to talk about fashion trips? So you, didn't you want to talk about fishing on the podcast? Oh, I think you said fashion trips. Well, you said trips. you went fishing. I just wanted to hear about it. Uh, <laughs> you like, wouldn't even tell you about, about that. Fucking, I don't want to fish on the podcast. I don't, I don't, yeah. Yeah. Well, you're the one that, taught, that told me you wanted to, because you had a couple fish stories too. Yeah, no, I just went fishing up north, uh, North California, and I was <laughs> fishing at the... I think the Sacramento River. I'm not sure. It was a big ass river, though. It looked like the ocean. It just like went on forever. And uh, yeah, I caught a couple of little strappers with some fucking night crawlers. And oh, actually, no, I was using anchovies. Using half, like cutting anchovies in half. Mm. And uh, fucking using anchovies sucks because mm. they stink real bad. They're funny looking. Just like you, stinky and funny looking. <laughs> there was a dude that took a fucking. Uh, he was fishing with mackerel. And a day later, my dad like pulled up a Facebook post of a guy that was at that exact spot and he had a fish that was almost as tall as him. I mean, granted, he was a pretty short, like Mexican dude, but he had a fucking, I don't like, think you needed to throw the Mexican. That thing is probably like 20 pounds. A <laughs> he good, was just like, a short man. That's all he had to say. You could have just said a short guy. It adds layers to the story. Kind of like a five layer beefy burrito. You know what I'm saying? Ooh, that he might enjoy since layer. you know. <laughs> He's Mexican. Mexican thing. Day. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Mexicans fucking hate Taco Bell. I know Me- Mexican. Hey, if you're Mexican, tell me in the tell us in the comment section. I'm pretty oh, sure it doesn't really matter what their race Taco is. Bell. It's probably just a personal preference. Well, yeah, I know that like a lot of oh, well, cause, <laughs> dude. I've I've been around Mexicans my entire life. My dad dude, like really? works, That's so cool. works in construction. Man, he works at so a fucking quirky. maintenance apartment complex you and he's just random he's always yeah. working with like mexican people i'm not uh, why, why are you guys thinking like it's like a bad thing like the word mexican is uh, has a negative connotation to it coming out of your mouth it's <laughs> okay sorry <laughs> <He's Spanish. laughs> okay what is that, your hold music <laughs> that's like, you're making uh, it worse what, I wasn't that's like me talking that. about chinese people you're all ding dong chicken at home ding dong chicken at home he's had a little song stuck in my head no you didn't it was unrelated so when you're you're ma- anybody you're says the word Mexican, way. you got to no, 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 no. no. tacos and did... enchilada burrito. Come on. Don't do that kind of shit. <laughs> I, what are you saying? I didn't do that. I just had a little song <laughs> in my head. He was just singing sure. a melody, dude. Sure. Just sure. Singing a little, it's a coincidence. Yeah. He just no, thought I of a little the... ditty right then and there. Yeah, it's an indie yeah. band. You wouldn't know yeah. them. Don't worry about them. <laughs> Anyways, I've been around Mexicans a lot. That's a fishing story? Ole. Did you catch one? Know, we, got, so we got sidetracked. <laughs> Did yeah, you I, catch one? <laughs> I caught a few little stripers, but nothing that was a hey, keeper. Okay, yo. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Well, I wanted... I, you made it seem like I had some insane fishing story. When I wanted to, to just tell you the other day that at one time I hooked a carp in his ass. <laughs> <laughs> that was literally the whole story. And you were like, oh, wait, wait, wait! Podcast. <laughs> oh yeah. No, you were the one that wanted to talk about it on the podcast. No. You told me you wanted to bring no. up some fish and stories down here. On no, I got two hundred boys that can vouch for me about who wants to talk about everything on the podcast. And I think I do, do believe it is you, good sir. I'm gonna Look, have I'm to watch the clown chain. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you don't have any like other than I, I carp. a carp in his ass on accident and it felt ah. weird reeling wow. him in and the fish was like was, spinning in circles in the water was like it running? wasn't even like like trying to swim away like properly it was like was spinning. it like in his tail or like it, directly in no, his asshole literally in his asshole in his butthole the, oh the hook was God. in his butthole yeah you didn't throw it back in the, in the lake did you yeah what am I gonna do with it <laughs> that fish is just gonna permanently have a damaged asshole <laughs> What, what, what am I supposed to do? Take him to the fucking ER? Don't eat it. Well, don't I mean, eat it. Isn't carp cannibal eat? Take him to the vet. I don't know. 
I don't know. I think carp are like fucking like. I think carp are like, like dirt they fish. They eat trash. Yeah, yeah, they eat like trash. So yeah. no, they're probably not good to eat. Also, his asshole's a lot of probably ruined from what he eats. Just right. in general. So probably did him a favor. <laughs> well, I've probably also heard that carp, it's hard to get uh, like bones out of carp. He also wasn't bleeding. It was literally just like in his asshole. Like it, it was just like, <laughs> like a imagine you something? put something up your ass well, and then you take it out. Plug. Yeah, it was. That's exactly. It was so weird. What? He was fine. He just. What if you pulled it out and the fish moaned? <laughs> just <laughs> just <laughs> Why'd you take it out? <laughs> Yeah, that's why he was Bro. swimming around in circles. He was doing all twisty motions on it. Yeah, gawk, gawk on his fucking butt. He finished. <laughs> he fin. I don't want to think. Okay. All right. <laughs> you shut your mouth. You shut your mouth. Why don't this you go print a-, a small bill or some shit, bitch? It's <laughs> not of any podcast. I'm going to print a boob pic and poop on it. <laughs> Please okay. do. Print bill and boob pic together. See what comes out. Take first. a shit on a glass coffee it. table while I lay underneath it so I can watch your sphincter release. I'm going to print out a picture of boobs and eat it. Like, shoot nice. Okay. Don't say right. that name. That's like Voldemort in these parts. Uh, true, true. He's on, you know he's on TikTok? He's everywhere. All he does is answer questions on TikTok. That's all he does. He's an Well, yeah, I'm sure a lot of people are curious about eating bicycle seats. Somebody asked a question. They, they said, what do, what do iPhone headphones sound like when you swallow them? And he, t- <laughs> he took yeah, his iPhone my, headphones. That's, that's from my fucking stream that I did. Oh, really? Uh, well, I yeah, actually like, this, saw it on TikTok. There was this old... A uh, clip of him doing that, and I got everybody that was watching me to go to his stream, and I was like, "Everyone, spam his chat and tell him to eat his headphones." And he <laughs> swallows live. He swallowed his fucking earbud things and was like, <laughs> <laughs> That's "Exactly what it sounded like." Yeah, it was fucking it hilarious. Just like that. <laughs> what do you think it sounded like when he shipped them out later? No, I mean he pulls them back out yeah. like spaghetti. <laughs> Ew. Ew. It's just so you can hear it, and then he. I don't think yeah, he like he like ear. stuck him. Yeah, he stuck him back in his ear, and then put him uh, back in his mouth. He's a maniac. Ew. Well, yeah, this is the same a, guy who mad lad who ate SpongeBob stickers in an alley because his wife yes. divorced him. It's kind yes. of funny because when I first heard about him, I remember he would like just drink like alcohol really fast, and I thought he was just one of those kind of dudes that just like like bad. Like, ah, I'm just gonna do this or... for do this for attention, get some viewers, and blah blah blah. And it just turns out he's just fucking crazy. Dude, he will drink a whole bottle of Everclear in like ten seconds. Yeah, I know, dude. That shit, like he that has, shit, there's will no way put he doesn't you in the up. grave. Yeah, yeah, there's no way he doesn't. Yeah, because I know that uh, the. Yeah, <laughs> have the, you seen the yeah. one of him doing shots of candle wax? <laughs> I think so. I feel like I've seen wax. Uh, what the hell? <laughs> yeah. Dude, that I would just like turn into like some shit like that. Does he have a disability? Hurt. I. I would consider it a superpower more than a disability. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like he's on the spectrum. Right. I mean, like you need stickers. <laughs> I feel like you'd have to be. And yeah. just the way he talks is very spectrum-y. Oh. Okay. That's not that go that way, Luigi. <laughs> so if I put a Y after that word, all of a sudden it's like offensive. Let's not go that way, well, Luigi. It was just, we know what word you replaced you were it with. Fucking <laughs> stupid. <laughs> we respect all people on the spectrum on this podcast. We respect from you. We remote. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you Leaner. really don't think about what you say before you say it, do you? He's like, kind of spectrum yeah, He sounds I mean, retarded. I, we've been doing this for three <laughs> fucking years. People that watch us understand that this is all. We're just. It's just comedy. I don't, I don't, mm. I, I don't, that I don't know. Was that, that like comedy? comedy. Nasty. Was that, that comedy that or was that like you being genuine? I mean, not, I mean no, I'm never genuine comedy. about, I'm never genuine about making fun of everybody or anybody. I mean, everybody, I accept everybody for who the fuck they are. I just, it's fun to make jokes. And a lot of people agree with that. It wasn't a joke. Make, you were just like, he sounds like he's spectrum me. <laughs> There's no joke there. It's just, he sounds retarded. Like, that's what you were saying. Like, if there was well, no I mean, joke. If anybody were to watch you nice like, and listen to him talk, they'd probably he agree sounds with me. Like, the joke would be, he sounds like like Bugs Bunny or something. That would be a joke. <laughs> eh? There, the, There yeah. is no joke. Are you when implying it's, Bugs sound- Bunny's retarded? Yeah, wait a minute. That's offensive. <laughs> no, I'm just using it as an example. That's the first thing I could think of. Not Bugs comment. Bunny on your mind? What the fuck? I just I don't thought know. of Spectrum a weird is. sounding cartoon character. I don't know. Just insert any name. <laughs> I, I, what was the topic? I, I'm not being serious, <laughs> and by the way, listeners and viewers and commenters. 
If you're on Are the you, spectrum, so you, you I love you. You think True Nice sounds normal then? No, I didn't say that. I just said, I don't. It's not like I respect him less or think any less of him because he sounds like that. No, I'm just wondering. I'm just trying I to disrespect figure... him because he eats stickers. That's why I have no respect for exactly. him. Exactly. Nothing... <laughs> okay, fair enough. <laughs> no, I would never. I don't. I don't ever hate or dislike or think less of anybody that has a, something they have no control over. And that is a that is a true sentence from Mr. McNasty himself on our Goons podcast. Quote me, pussy. Old you, you spectrum me ass pussy. Yeah, I'm talking you soup. Like spectrum me ass st- pussy. <laughs> you fucking with right some spectrum me ass pussy. <laughs> you have Beat a spectrum ass pussy. All right, do we you have a topic? Have you ever what? seen like people that are uh, autistic, but they're also don't. like don't. really, really like talented at something? Yeah, that's very yes. common. That's, that's they're usually savants common. at stuff. Jesus. That's fucking crazy, dude. No, this is a real topic. Soup. I'm not. Oh, no, shut no, the no, fuck up. Actually- they're usually they're the fact that you're laughing means that you're fucked up because you think I'm making fun of autistic people and I'm not. It, this is like you just seeing true. a retarded kid just laughing at his face. You can't oh, be laughing at happened. the way you said that. I'm laughing at the way you, like you were like because you I know, said the there, word there autistic. There are autistic people in the world that are good at things. <laughs> no shit. That's that's <laughs> common with almost all of them. They're. They're Man, usually I'm really upset. It's funny because the other the bargain do completely understand what I meant by that, and you're like oh, laughing like a, I mean, just insulted all of them. It's or something. the way you said it. It's just the way you said it. You said it so like dry. <laughs> I get it. He's saying like, can you believe it? That they're good at something. Like, oh, this is <laughs> unbelievable. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's the way you said it. All right. Can we get on to the topic though? What yes. Okay. Topic? Autistic people have talent. Yeah. Let's talk about it. Yep. Okay, do you were gonna embellish on it, so go ahead, do. Well, I just I remember this 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 um autistic artist that was brought up in like a helicopter above the New York oh, skyline yeah. for the first time and he was able to draw it by memory from seeing it once. Stuff like yeah. that. Uh-huh. You know, just super it's almost like superpowers. It's actually really impressive. Yeah. yeah, there was one that I saw where this girl could draw she was like four and she could draw for some reason like horses. Like in different like positions, like either like up in the air or just she could just draw a horse like perfectly. She was like four. Yeah. I, uh, Fucking it's weird. They'll be like really good at like one specific thing and like. Right. Like, and they'll, like they'll usually power. struggle with like communication and, and speech yeah. and stuff like that. Uh-huh. That's usually one of the biggest things that that's like the downside. Uh, I've, I've like, seen that kid that can go like above like a city and just. He'll take like a snapshot in his brain and just be able to draw the fucking city. Even like the cars, like the position of the cars on the road and shit. Yeah, it's insane. Like things that are very like variable, like things that move in the city. And he'll just like, yeah, it's fucking crazy. A good memory is super common with it too. Like being able to memorize every word of a movie from watching it once. Um really? stuff like that. Yeah. yeah. I can hear you playing RuneScape. <laughs> My incessant <laughs> clicking. <is> just- <laughs> I heard some of them are really good at RuneScape. Yeah. <laughs> also named Eric. And guitar. Uh, what do you guys say? <laughs> Do we have another topic? <laughs> can we please, yeah, can we please change the topic, please? I was trying to fucking praise autistic people, but I think my, we're gonna go. My, my cousin is is extremely autistic, and he can eat his sock, so that's something. <laughs> <laughs> well, good for him. Now that's talent. I'm glad yeah. that he's going places. Yeah, his, mo- <laughs> his, his mom. His mom has to pair an ex- or bring an extra pair of socks sometimes. It's. He's got he actually habit. swallows. He them? eats a yeah, sock. He, he can eat a whole ass sock, man. It's crazy. That's impressive, actually. Yeah, yeah. He'll never go hungry. Like, do people just <laughs> eat an item of clothing? I feel like that's hard. I mean, he. <laughs> like, he's not like he can't just chew up a sock and break it up like food. Oh no, he did. <laughs> really? Does he have, yeah, does but he he just have was, canine teeth? Just all sharp? I, I, bro, I couldn't don't, tell don't you. Don't let him just, go in the old navy alone. I was just with him, <laughs> and I brought him down to like when I lived at my parents. I brought him down to my room. We were just hanging out. And he just started taking his sock off and eating it. And I was like, hey, don't, don't do that. And then I went upstairs. I was like, he's eating his sock. And she's like, oh, he always does that. And just pulled out an extra. And- <laughs> they he let him? always <laughs> does that. They oh, lo- that's, just, that's just old David. He's just what a sock is- eater. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's... Uh- he's, he, he's, he's a hungry boy, though. When, when, when my dad owned grocery stores, he used to just go through the aisles, grab like... 30 bags of chips and just 
Fucking <laughs> weird, 30 bags of socks. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah so like 30 pairs eating, of socks. Yeah, yeah, he's he's eating socks. something that's fucking edible. <laughs> yeah. you know, not, not a literal. Yeah, he's, he's a mad lad. But, so uh, his, no. his shits must have to be this terrible, right? I don't know. I haven't checked them out, McNasty. <laughs> well, <laughs> I, mean, I, would, I would ask that to somebody that takes care of them. <laughs> I mean, how does your body process a sock? Does it break it down like your stomach acid? Nasty. Blind, your I homework, don't know. Your homework is to put your nose in the dookie of your autistic cousin. That's your homework, Blar. Ask him for a picture of it. No. Bro, he doesn't understand pictures. He's that bad, huh? Oh, yeah, no. he's like extreme. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Jesus whoa. fucking Christ. Nasty. This he's is what I've been saying the whole time. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. He's like that. Like that. That's what I've been saying the whole whoa. time. He's that. It's I'm going to say like. McNasty's oh yes. my process. God. That's yes, what I've been saying. His case is that severe, McNasty. His case is that severe. He is that severe. He's a wonderful person. Love hanging out with him. He thinks he thinks that's okay. too. <laughs> McDessie thought that was fine when he said it, but it's really not. It's just, just not. <laughs> that, oh, he's that retarded, huh? <laughs> wow. He's <laughs> that stupid? Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Man, I feel so sure about myself dude. after this conversation. Wow, we... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Bruh. There, there is. It's called a spectrum, and some people are farther on it than others. Farther on it, right? Oh, Thank you. God damn. We don't well, refer to them as bad. <laughs> it's so fucked. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I gotta make. Does, does your, no, you're not. I gotta make no, an apology not. video after this. <laughs> Find a, do you have a white wall in your room that's really I do. like washed out? I think out? so, okay. yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. In your house. Okay, make, good. make sure you take a deep breath on camera before you start talking. So everybody Dude, knows you're flustered. <laughs> does, your does, your does your cousin have speech issues? Like, does. Um, yeah, oh, yeah, it's your cousin, right? Yeah, he doesn't does talk anymore. He doesn't talk um, anymore? Has, he doesn't talk at all? Has no. your. Has anyone tried, like, typing on, like, a, a board or with, um, with an iPad with them? Because that, that therapy works uh, pretty well. Why do I'm you not know sure. This? I mean, yeah. Somebody I know works with um, oh, that's people right. like this. Yeah. Um, that's right. But yeah, no, I'm not, I'm not 100% sure what, what exactly uh, the therapy, but it's really odd because, like, when I was younger, I, like, specifically remember sitting down, like, playing Pokemon with him and stuff, and, like, mm -hmm. I remember being able to have conversation. Like, it wasn't, like, like, okay. he just, he seemed awkward back when, like, when we were super young. Um and then, like, as, obviously, as he got older, it just, like, got more severe. Um, it's really, it was really odd. Because, like, it was, like, one year I saw him, and, you know, he just seemed awkward. And then another year when I saw him, is like, his case was a lot worse. So, it was, I don't know, it was really weird. I didn't know that, like, autism could work like that, where somebody could be, um, you know, relatively speaking, you know, normal from the outside, and then it progressed into something else. It's kind of crazy. I didn't know it was like that. I yeah. thought it was just, like, you were born with it and just never, like, developed further past a certain point. You know, I commentated my local Special Olympics one time. Did you really? Oh my god. That I sounds did. like a disaster if I'm being yeah, honest. <laughs> it's not a joke. I actually did. I'd like huh. help film it and I I did the talking over it. I feel like that'd be pretty fun. Yeah. <laughs> that'd be a good yeah. fucking time. <laughs> think think about that, huh? What, you, what think you, you, you think I'm the biggest what? piece of shit? <laughs> it's probably second. I mean, you're well, using it like, as like leverage to, to prove you're a good person. Jokes. So. Well, I would hope not. <laughs> I'd really Dude, fucking hope not. You'd get instantly kicked out if you made one even the slightest joke. <laughs> yeah, that that is fair, I would reckon. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're not really there to, like, yeah. you know, make And I'm making a video out of it. Yeah, you're not you're not trying to do funny moments at the special Olympics. <laughs> yeah, special, I wasn't really filming special, special Olympics, Olympics funny moments. Funny moments. <laughs> This is the worst conversation. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Holy shit! All this of our listeners fun. that have like a mild case of autism are just gonna disappear. They're just gonna fucking hate us after if, this. I, I guarantee that the people that watch us, that have, that are the part of the things that mm -hmm. we have made fun of, love that. There's we get comments all the time from people who are like, "I'm Mexican. I thought that fucking joke was hilarious. I'm Asian. I the stereotype jokes well, are fucking the good great." Thing, the thing about comedy is that. You have to make fun of everyone, so everyone feels included. Exactly. We don't <laughs> ever leave anybody. Even white people. I mean, you make fun of fucking dumbass rednecks and shit all the time. We hate everyone. Yeah, it's equally. not hard. 
We hit everyone. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> just make fun of everybody so everyone feels included, you know? Like, yeah. imagine if you were at, like, a, a comedy club and the, like, comedian made fun of everybody but then skipped over the guy in the wheelchair. Like, he would feel like <laughs> right. shit. You know what I mean? He would feel yeah. more like shit that he didn't get made fun of yeah. than if he was to have been made fun of or, right. you know? Exactly. Yeah. Within reason, like you don't want to just like you yeah, you don't. That's the thing. You have you have to find the balance it has between to be like funny. what's funny yeah. and, just, just, and just like a slur and not funny and just right. nothing yeah, to it. Exactly. Don't don't be McNasty. Look at him and be like, "Hey, you're pretty bad yeah, off. Yeah, huh? you're that fucking bad, huh, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're a piece you're, of shit, McNasty. Yeah, you really are garbage. You're gonna burn. I'm home. not that you're bad of a person. Eh. I. <laughs> I'm not you have to that express that the really person. bad person. <laughs> <laughs> said the villain in the movie <laughs> when he was that called. Bad. <laughs> hey, okay, I'm I'm a good I'm a good person. Shut the fuck up, okay? <laughs> if you guys if you guys saw me in 2016, you would be annoyed by how much I cared about like shit, like it's social issues and and uh, people oh, political McNasty. people people not caring about stuff. I love like, one eighth educated political McNasty. <laughs> I love barely GED. Well, I was saying like in, two, <laughs> in, tw- in 2016, I was way too much. I, I had friends isolate me. My family was annoyed by me because I was just constantly always talking about. I'm like, annoyed by you. You need to do this and, and respect this group and your words are better and you can't even make, you can't say the word. You annoyed the fuck out of me. Yeah. And uh, it's like, uh, I hate just you. fucking everything is <laughs> yeah. just funny. Everything's just a joke to me, you know, except for. Like That's good. So. No, I definitely like this version better. Yeah, this sounds way better. <laughs> well, if I was still like that, just hardcore, very vocal liberal, I wouldn't be here with you guys today. I want, I I want Bernie Bro McNasty. <laughs> I can get Bernie Bro on you. I want to shit blood. Dog go. Why? All right. Do Why we have not? a Do we have a topic? I don't know. It's been fifty minutes, and has it? We've been, we've been just been going off of a. Uh, has it really been that long? Here. God. Yeah, I'm a solid waste of 30 minutes, minutes of just talking about autism. Yeah. And that's, like mm-hmm. five minutes of truck. Like every successful podcast does. Yep. Uh, un- unbelievable. This podcast is is unbelievable. I'm it is one of that. a kind. It it's really just, is. I'm going to be hey. very sad if one of our recordings like fucks up. I no. hope mine does. I hope mine <laughs> stops right now. Yeah. I hope it breaks. This so is the world, the world never has to hear this podcast. It started <laughs> off awful and just somehow got worse. <laughs> Way worse. <laughs> I don't understand how we oh. immediately went from truck to autism. Like I don't Well the two are remember right the now. process of that. Uh, yeah. Usually that was never mind. Yeah they go hand in hand. <laughs> the two coincide. <laughs> There's a reason the rednecks all drive trucks, McNasty. Hey now. Oh, you're an all-star. Camel, come on now, camel humper. Calm <laughs> down. Camel humper. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder. I wonder what the amount of times a camel has been humped by a human. I would like to At see that seven. statistic. I mean, At I got seven? like six or six, six to ten under the belt. So, <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say seven for myself. So, oh, all right, I'm call it a little hump for nothing, baby. <laughs> you were gonna have sex with an animal. What kind okay, of animal? no, we're not doing that. Now, that's a good topic. I no, like that. I heard that, topic, that, sheep, that. I heard that sheep pussy is pretty close to human pussy. Where did you hear that from? Where did you hear that from? Cool, because I I want to I want their ass. I, I have questions. <laughs> <laughs> there was a guy in my town that got caught. Uh, because my this the school here is like an it's like an agricultural area where you can like oh, farm so. and stuff. He's talking about and himself. And apparently right now, somebody by the way. some dude like <laughs> late at night. No, this I was probably like fucking fifteen when this happened. But some exactly. dude that went to the school like late at night was caught fucking a sheep. And he was like shunned. Yeah, that has to be the most embarrassing thing. Wow, what is? I always want to know what you're like. Friends, what would your cock feel like afterwards? Like, is is it acidic? Does it fall off? Does it just explode like a firework? Like, what does your dick do after you fuck a sheep? McNasty seemed like probably goes limp. So, for some reason, I've seen I've seen somewhere with like an interview with like a fucking the prisoner or something that looks like a professional sheep fucker. <laughs> Guinness World Record. I've been doing it for twenty fight. years. <laughs> He's just in a full like NASCAR suit. Yeah, I'm a sheep pussy. Especially when you enter from underneath the sheep well, and go upwards. 
You hit that fucking sheep G spot and it gets all squirty. Yeah, it gives you a little oh sheep bone. Oh my god. Well, there is. <laughs> so, uh, but not, <laughs> not everybody. This is not a normal person, but there is a small group of people in Colombia who fuck donkeys on a regular <laughs> basis. Like, it's like, it's like a coming of age thing. Address? You have to- <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> like, it's like the outskirts rednecks of Colombia. Like, and, and they just. Me? Plow donkey I never ass. fuck no donkey. <laughs> You're not in Colombia, are you, Sue? But given the chance, I ain't never fuck no donkey. But you, got a, you got a big, hot, sweaty donkey, Sue. What you doing? Wife. <laughs> well, I mean, if no one's looking, try <laughs> chopping its head off. Okay, that was... And fucking its throat. <laughs> but if I'm in public... <laughs> I wonder how that's possible, because I'm pretty sure that donkeys have the same reaction as horses. Like they, they're, they're they like, like kick they you kick in the stomach and break thing. your ribs. But, but if, they're, if, they're, if they're used to donkey dick, then your little peck are not going to do nothing. Yeah, you won't even notice. Yeah, I just true. don't think it's a little fly climbing up there. <laughs> a little fly climbing on up there, just making his way. I in. just, I, I couldn't imagine standing in front of an animal, a stinky, stupid <laughs> animal like a fucking donkey, and my dick getting hard, and be like, I'm gonna fuck it until I come. Like. A, what? Like this is well, not I guess you ain't educated enough. Yeah, <laughs> I think I'm too educated. Which is you're saying pretty a lot vanilla. Is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing you're a vanilla bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm kinky. I like to plow donkey ass. <laughs> no, this kind of kinky fuck Handcuffs and whips. I'm I'm in the no, donkey. No, just handcuff the donkey to the bed. <laughs> I'm gonna handcuff that hoof, baby. <laughs> <laughs> you're like You've been a bad the donkey. donkey. And shit. <laughs> well, wouldn't it be a hoof cuff at that point? Yes, yeah. it would be a yeah, hoof cuff. It would be a hoof cuff. Hoof cuff. Hoof cuff. Interesting. Interesting. That's a weird. Hoof cuff. How do you? I don't don't understand. How do you get caught fucking a sheep? Like what? And why though? Cameras. Like what? Cameras. He probably thought that wasn't fucking. I think it was a street camera that picked it up. Imagine being the guy that saw that on the street camera. (laughs) (laughs) He starts dragging off. Pay me enough, man. As a cop, I I could not. It's just like oh, I'm watching a robbery. Oh well, over here I'm watching a guy fuck a sheep. So. That is insane. I, dude, I could not be a judge or a cop for that reason. Like, just the possibility <laughs> of one day I'm going to have, I'm going to get an MP4 file emailed to me of a guy <laughs> railing a sheep. Imagine no you have thanks. to do the sentencing on that guy. Like, the court hereby <laughs> gives you three to six years for having sex with a donkey. Like, what are the, yeah, what are the I'm repercussions? Just be the whole time. What are the repercussions for fucking a sheep? And uh, the fact that there are there are ones set out means that it's happened enough that they having have to intercourse yeah, that's, that's, with that's a animal concerning crime. Part. Yeah, I'm, the fact I'm googling having intercourse with animal for, crime. The pu- punishments for bestiality is two years in jail and five thousand dollars maximum fine. Oh, that's not bad. Who, who do you pay that to? <laughs> who it's gets that money? With it. I reckon you pay the sheep back. You know, for yeah, its, for its business. <laughs> You're a sex offender if you fuck an animal. You should I think be. deserve that. D- yeah, yeah, dude, you're fucking you're fucking something that doesn't have the ability uh, to say s- no. I mean, you, you, you're yeah. fucking sex offender. Wait, what? It, That's never mind. That is that is. Uh, what if the animal can say yes? Is that what you're gonna say? <laughs> he was what if the dog? Like that. What if the dog humps no. you first? <laughs> what if you fuck a parrot? <laughs> it says yes. <laughs> <laughs> what if I only teach the word harder <sighs> to the Wait. parrot? There are some places in America where it's legal to uh, fuck California. animals. California, Col- Colorado, DC. They- how, much, how much you want to bet? <laughs> like that's your luck. <laughs> Too Those I don't know the what places. these states are. Hold on. They I literally have. I, I know that people <clears throat> will go to Mexico to watch like donkey shows. Like a girl fuck a donkey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm whoa, sorry. Whoa, 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 whoa. You make it do dubstep. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> people pay. To watch a girl People get pegged watch, by like, an animal. Show, People yeah, pay yeah. It, real money. It's legal to fuck an animal what? in New Mexico, Wyoming, and West Virginia. Of okay. course, <laughs> it is. Okay, it is. That checks out. It's so. It, why is that not a federal law? That's what Wikipedia is telling me. Uh, it is. It's imprisonment everywhere else in America. <laughs> well, actually, no. There's there are some where it's uh. So oh, you, life in prison. No, oh, okay, so life. Yeah, no, there there are some where you just go to prison, and there are others where it's, it's up to life in prison. Some countries there there are two countries with the death penalty for fucking <laughs> what an animal. Oh my god! A lot what? of Africa is unknown status. Questionable <laughs> there, Africa. <laughs> Depends wow. on the um, animal. It's legal in all of Russia. So really, well, they probably fucking 
grizzly well, bears I mean, over there. Yeah, I was gonna say they're you know. It's probably why their women are so ugly. Well, actually, that's weird though because <laughs> Russians are either like a zero or a ten. Yeah, I know it's weird. Yeah, it's kind of crazy. Well, it's probably like the zeros are the people fucking horses, and then the tens are the people that are fucking humans. <laughs> Hey man, <laughs> it's legal to fuck in Jamaica, man. Really? Oh, it's legal for foreigners to come to Jamaica and fuck <gasps> animals. So, Goons Jamaican boys, trip. Goons trip. <laughs> yes. Yeah, we know we're going on. I'm going to lose the get some jerk chicken and we can jerk Woo! a chicken. <laughs> I love okay, Goons Field okay. Trip. At the Guantanamo Bay Naval Base. <laughs> It is, it, it is legal for citizens, but illegal for armed service members since September 2016. That'll That's a reason why. Don't join the army. <laughs> well, just you go, to Cuba, uh, go to Cuba and don't become an army man, and you're good. You can go to Guantanamo Bay and fuck their little brains. Oh out. my god, this is a rabbit hole. I wonder what it's law. like to visit Me when I'm fogging a rabbit <laughs> in Jamaica. I'm doing a rabbit Jamaica. from behind in Jamaica. <laughs> I wonder what it's like to visit Guantanamo Bay. I kind of always thought about that. I like, to just walk around. I was wrong. I was I, wrong. What? I was wrong. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Uh, in Russia, it is legal to fuck an animal unless the animal is hurt. That is... <laughs> <laughs> what? What if it gets hurt during? Like, you take a little kinky stuff a little too far. Well, you better hope the GoPro footage is going to be viable for the police to look over and review. <laughs> Make sure you're not I'm trying lying. to determine if the goat is in pain. I <laughs> oh, dude, I'm actually like uncomfortable now. Like that's nasty. That is so fucked. Like, hey, oh did this did this boss god. sound like it was in pain to you, or was that a boss pleasure? I can't tell. Hmm. Oh my god. Hmm, I'm gonna have to scrub that one back and mm, watch yeah. over that again. <laughs> oh yeah, I'll be back. <laughs> I wish wow. I was ill today. I didn't have to listen to this. Man, there's, over. There's a lot of uh, <laughs> uh this is a rabbit hole of laws. Yeah, I don't want to go I don't want to go any further into the animals. That hey. was not a pun. <laughs> <laughs> don't just the tip. <laughs> sure you don't, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> don't be shy. <sighs> yeah. Don't say oh, that Blark's never taught you well, nothing. It's up to ten years in prison for you, Blark, so Oh really? I was just considering yeah. it. Whoopsies. Well that's not too bad. That's <laughs> worth the risk. No, it's yeah, no, sure. Can we end it? Blark's going to have sex print, with a camel. Print out the podcast on Spotify <laughs> and then go fuck an animal. <laughs> <laughs> also, autism cool. Cool truck. And cool, cool truck. Yeah. <laughs> and catch bass by the ass. This is not getting ads <laughs> for anything. <laughs> Man, this is, this is wild. Yeah. Well, thanks for listening. Download, like, comment, cut. subscribe, subscribe, <laughs> and like Spotify.